let's meet the starting lineup for the visiting Phoenix Suns. At small forward, Utah Watanabe. At center, DeAndre Ayton. At point guard, Bradley Beal. At the other guard position, Devin Booker. At forward, Kevin Durant. The head coach of the visiting team is Frank Vogel. Let's meet the starting five for the Portland Trail Blazers. Starting at small four, standing six five, number four, Matisse Thibel. And guard, standing six five, number seventeen. Shaden Sharp. Set top by that play cleanest is Bosnia and Herzegovina. Roy Price and Serum. Yosef Narke. The other forward, standing six foot eight, number nine, Jeremy Grant. Six three, wearing the letter of Damian Lillard. Hello out there, and get ready for some NBA basketball on 2K Sports. I'm Brian Anderson at the table with Grant Hill and Brent Barry. Our reporter is Ali LaForce. Now let's take a look at the rookie rankings. As we hit the halfway mark in the regular season, here's who has taken the lead in the rookie of the year race. Well, you look at Henderson. So far this season, he's been rock solid, helping out his team and turning in strong performances that have earned him the four spot. And that's a pretty solid position at number four. Will he be higher or lower on that list once the season ends? Well, there is potential to be higher. It's just a matter of how his body holds up at this point. The rest of the season is really going to be a grind. So let's take a look at the Phoenix Suns starting lineup. The deadly duo of Beal and Booker at the one and the two. Two great players inside. They have KD at eight. And it's Watanabe in at the small forward position. And for Portland, sharp teams with Thibel on the perimeter. Inside, it's Grant and Nurkic. And it's Lillard in at the point. Well, at least on paper, this one appears to be lopsided. But you can never count out a team in this league, Brent. And we know both teams know that. I expect this to be a hard-fought game for that reason alone. Nobody likes being told that they don't have a chance. And Grant with a nice heads-up play, willing to make the next pass. Durant, the pass to Aiden. Outside Booker. Pass to Aiden. For three, Durant. It's rebounded by Grant. Lillard outside. For three. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. And Lillard a flat-out gunner from deep because he's just a lethal shooter from way outside. against Durant. Pass to Watanabe. Now here's Booker. Back to Durant. And Durant with the big finish. Yeah, not going to get over on KD here. If you give him a chance to attack the basket, he'll be at the rim. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. Now Thibel. Lillard outside. Takes a three. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. The coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. Now here's Aiden. 
Right now, contributing around 10 and a half points a game. Here's Watanabe. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. Here's Sharp. First quarter, just about two minutes in. Driving inside. No luck on that one. Beal with some nice D. The Suns have gone one for three so far. Aiden with a screen. Beal, the pass to Aiden. Outside for Booker. Up top, Durant. Just five to shoot. Tries it from 16. That one's good for two. Durant's got his second bucket of the night. Oh, KD just filthy from the mid-range, unguardable most of the time. Lillard against Beal. Lillard passes to Nurkic. Oh, Beal picks his pocket. Watanabe on the wing from outside the arc. Rebound by the Trailblazers. The Suns beat them last time when these two met in Phoenix. They were out-hustled on the boards the last time these teams met. Well, the Blazers have boasted some high-powered offenses in recent years. Well, their success is always centered around what they've done on the offensive end, the A, but now they've lost a little bit of that potency, and they've got to get back to more balance so that they can be competitive on a nightly basis. Aiden passes to Durant. Here's Watanabe. It's Beal on the wing, defended by Lillard. Pass to Aiden. Booker with it from deep. Can't get it to go. Missed his first one. <laughs> Just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. Booker against Lillard. Now Nurkic. There's the drive. And Nurkic throws it down. Top big body there with Nurkic coming through. He knows he's got size on most guys he's going to play against. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Beal against Lillard. Beal attacking. It's stolen by Nurkic. From about 19. And Aiden pulls it down. Well, that mid-range, Jay, usually pretty much on the money. Maybe the timing just a little bit off on that one. Watanabe sets a screen. Here's Durant. Solid shot from a distance of about 14 feet. Durant's got six. And it's Lillard with a ball for the Trailblazers. Beyond the arc. Hits the trifecta. The big story thus far, how well they've shot the rock. The Suns trailing. Hayden finds Booker. Puts up a three. Oh, drew the foul and almost hit the three-point bucket. But he'll head to the line for three. Well, you might as well throw up the points. Booker shot 90% from the free throw line during the regular season. That free throw good from Booker. And one thing about Devin Booker, he continually hones his offensive game, Brent. Yeah, I'm trying to find a weakness in what Devin Booker can provide you offensively, and there aren't any. His strengths are absolutely elite. Shot creation, great range. He's a clutch performer. This guy is a special offensive talent. And he's good on the second. Well, Brent, settling into the season now, what would you tell teams that are, by their own admission, underperforming? Well, the first thing you want to do is identify the problem. And in some cases, that can be obvious. But sometimes it's confusing, B.A., and you think you have what you need. It's just not quite working out. And he nails the third. You know, Brent, for the Suns franchise, it's hard to believe they've never won an NBA title. Pretty incredible with the uh, ring of honor in Phoenix that they have, the amount of Hall of Fame players that have put on that jersey. And they've lost the finals a few times, up 2-0 back in the 21 finals. They've had a couple of MVPs, some fantastic teams. The title is the last frontier for the Phoenix Suns. Pass to Watanabe. Booker surveying the D. Inside. Here's Watanabe. Pocket four. Fires from deep. 
And Booker hits yeah. from deep. Booker's got six. And Booker's got one of the quickest releases in the game. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. Kevin Durant with a rebound. Phoenix has gone one for five from three-point range. A cold start. Aiden inside. Nurkic is there. Pass to Watanabe. Beal from outside. Another three for Phoenix. And what's working here, each guy is willing to make the next pass. The Trailblazers have got six of ten attempts to fall. Outside Tybal. Back to Sharp. There's the triple. Portland, no good that time either. And that's exactly how tightly you have to guard him every time he steps to the arc. He's just that good. Offensive board. Booker, the pass to Aiden. Outside Durant. Aiden, a screen on Tybal. Watanabe on the wing. Out to Beal. Takes the three. Tybal with the board. Portland has gone three for five from deep so far in this matchup. Lillard with the ball. Beal picks him up. And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three-point play. Gordon, he's checked in for Watanabe. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for Portland. Well, we're in the era of the three-point basket. So if you want to win games in this league, you have to connect from deep. And they have been thus far. So much good energy and flow tonight, and that has really come out of great ball movement. Guys have been open, and as soon as they are, they get the ball. Aiden, the screen on Grant, pass to Beal. Back to Duran. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. They come into this one following the loss to Minnesota. On the road, they got owned defensively. They just couldn't match the activity level of their opponent. Well, let's hope there isn't any carryover from that letdown in this one. Kind of amazing that Lillard wasn't a big-time prospect at a high school friend. Well, size had a lot to do with that, D.A., and then Damian Lillard, it's, it's hard to scout Will, and he certainly has loads of that. Not many guys have a feel for the game like Dame does. Well, looking back, it wasn't too long ago, Grant. The Blazers had an eight-year playoff streak. NBA, that's no easy task. Some great years, but couldn't get over the hump. Now I think it's time to reset and build around their youth. The Suns making a switch here. Okogi's checked in. And the second free throw is good. There's so many qualities of a lead guard that Damian Lillard possesses. On the floor, in the locker room, he really, truly sets the standard. And he makes all three. And a great player on a great role at the charity stripe. The D has got to be careful about being too aggressive on him and sending him back for freebies. Now here's Aiden. He picked up 12 points in their last win against the Lakers. Screen by Durant. Here's Okogi. Hey, great D that time from Grant. Well, the D's so tight on him, it makes him alter his shot. And an easy chance turns into a tough one because the defense is swarming. Here's Sharp. No made baskets yet. For three, here's Lillard. Okogi pulls down the board. Outside Booker. The kick to Durant. Here's Okogi. Defended by Lillard. Here's Gordon. Gets it to go from the corner. And once Eric Gordon receives that pass, he's just rising up. So a natural rhythmic jump shot. And so Lillard will bring it up for the Portland Trailblazers. Four-point game. Oh, Bucker with a block. Outside Durant. Pass to Okogi from downtown. The shot, no good. Good work defensively by Thibel. Fast break, here we go. Count it from distance. Excellent transition player. Once he is on the break, Sharp is ready to take flight. Booker with it. Picked up by Grant. Durant, looking around. Pass to Aiden. The three is up. Oh, thanks that one. He's 0 for 1 to start. For Portland, they've got 8 of 15 shots to go. Sharp passes to Lillard. To the right side. Back to Thibault. 
And he takes the fantastic lead pass up strong for the slam. Uh, Nurkic getting more and more comfortable at finding the open men on this team. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Outside Durant. Puts one up from 19. That one rolls around and rims out. And it's the Trailblazers ball. Stringing it together. They've got an 11-2 run going. Here's Sharp. And so far, he's averaging seven points a game. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. And again, it's Portland with a three. And they are letting those threes fly from outside. Really in a great rhythm. Phoenix calls timeout. So for the Blazers, Littles checked in for Thibel. Anthony Simons comes in for Sharp. And it's Henderson in for Damian Lillard. Bowl, he's checked in for Phoenix. Beal comes in for Durant. Beal, the pass to Okogi. Pass to Bowl. Portland grabs the miss. Not going to see that very often. The defense in the vicinity, but still, he's not one to blow layups. Grant finds Simons. Nurkic, a screen on Booker. Simons passes to Nurkic. Second shot opportunity. Outside for Henderson. From the arc. Bull grabs the board. Unfortunately for them, they're reeling at this point. So true. Very little going their way right now at either end of the floor. Now here's Gordon. Back to Bull. And finished off by Bull. That's unblockable. Unless they can get a bigger man on him, got to learn your lesson. So it's Portland now. Ten-point lead. Simons passes to Henderson. Back to Simons. The three. Bowl grabs the board. And the Suns shooting only 37% early. Ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. The Phoenix Suns have proof that one smart trade can make a big impact for him. Now, B.A., I'm going to challenge you here. Is it smart to put Kevin Durant on your team? Of course it is. I mean, that's a blockbuster deal. The franchise went for it. They grabbed the talent. They grabbed one of the best players of all time to join this core to see if they could push themselves to an NBA championship. Brown, he's checked in for Portland. Lillard comes in for Grant. Both free throws good from Gordon. Well, the Trailblazers shooting with confidence in this one. 48% in the first quarter. They set the pick. Here's Lillard. Portland, no good that time either. I admire the play call. They just couldn't capitalize. Yeah, an efficient offensive possession. They found the look that they wanted, just didn't go in. Portland leading. Simons outside. And a miss there on the triple. Three second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Hold the screen on Henderson. And Beal launches from deep. No good from outside. Henderson left side. And he dunks it down. So far, they're owning both ends of the floor. We'll see if they can keep this going. Like tonight, that all the hustle plays have meant so much to this team. Now just sustain some of that energy and keep comfortable. And we've reached the end of the first quarter. It's the Trailblazers leading by eight. And the second quarter about to get started. We'll be back in a moment. Hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. And looking at what we've seen from the Trailblazers, what do you guys think? We all know good ball movement is what most coaches harp on. And their passing's been excellent so far. 
Well, everybody just feeling the energy of the basketball as they moved it around and lots of hands were touching it. And so Beal will bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. Trailing by eight. And after this one, they're at home against Sacramento. And that's a one-game homestand for the club. On the court right now, second quarter for the Suns. We've got Bo Bowl. Eric Gordon is out there with Bradley Beal. Then it's Josh Okogie. And it's Bates Diop in at the four-man position. Lillard passes to Simons. Lillard outside. Free ball from Lillard. Yeah, Damian Lillard, this is some Oaktown response. You make one, I got you back. Pass to Okogie. Here's Bates Diop. Let's the three fly. And it's Little with a rebound. Henderson against Gordon. Oh, sweet move. And it's laid in by Henderson. And it's a 10-point Portland lead. And their offensive execution has really picked up here in the second period. Gordon, right side. Here in the second quarter, a little over a minute of play. Kogi on the wing. Here's Bates Diop. He's scoreless. And looks like an illegal pick was set. That gets the ref's attention. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. Gotta hold firm or you're gonna get a call. Watanabe's checked in for Bates Diop. Second quarter of action, about a minute and a half play. And there is a whistle. That goes on Damian Lillard. That's his first foul of the game. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. Well, DeAndre Ayton has big goals. He said, quote, I want to be the best young two-way player in the league, controlling the game even if I'm not scoring the ball. Being everywhere, creating shots, rolling, blocking shots, just being in the paint, loud, communicating, that's my type of basketball. He's got all the tools, Allie. Thanks for that. Good stuff there. Now approaching two minutes of action here in the second. Watanabe passes to Gordon. Pass to Beal. Four on the clock. Here's Watanabe. There's the block. Now here's Simon. He's covered closely. For instance, you retired in 09. The game has really changed. What's your favorite part of how basketball is played now? Yeah, B.A., I think it's just the amount of skill and freedom that really coaches have allowed guys to play with. There's so much skill on the floor at every position, and it's a read-and-react offense. So the smarter you are, the more that you can process, and the quicker that you can do that, you can get advantage every time. And when you start to see those teams flow, it starts to become something really special. It's always been about shooting. Maybe the league forgot about for a couple of years. And Simon's really settling in to what he is in this league, and that is a microwave score that can come in and get buckets. Phoenix no good that time either. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Pass to Lillard. Launches it. Again, the miss by the Trailblazers. The Suns have gotten only one of four shots to go in to the paint. Bold pass to Okogi. Gordon against Henderson. Wadadabi sets a screen to stop the drought. And down it goes. Dunked it through off a beautiful setup. That's just great vision from Gordon on that pick and roll. Saw the floor well. Here's Lillard. He had a 27-point outing in their last game against the Timberwolves in Minnesota. And his free throw numbers tell you a lot about his performance. He was very aggressive. And you can't leave the basket unprotected. Bad things will happen to you. Yeah, that was just way too easy. Will not find a higher percentage opportunity than that. Hold screen on Henderson. Gordon down low. Defended by Henderson. Watanabe. 
Off target from three-point range. Hate to say it, but if they're still trailing at the final buzzer, a lot of this is going to be felt by him. His shooting tonight has just been atrocious. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Neal outside. Pass to Watanabe. There's the screen by Bull. There's the three. Watanabe can't get it to go. Well, that's not a shot he's ever going to pass up, and he should, despite the miss. No defender anywhere near him. He's got to shoot that one. Henderson finds Simons. For three, here's Lillard. And count it. 8 of 14 now. He's rolling. They're unafraid to let it rip from downtown, extending their lead. And so Beal will bring it up for the Suns. It's a 16-point game. Coming into this, having knots to win against the Lakers in their last game. And it's just so hard to stop them when they're scoring at that level. They were efficient and didn't let up at all. They had never stopped working. One of those games where just everybody was making shots, continual flow, and a very professional win. So for the Blazers, Nurkic has checked in for Brown. Seibel comes in for Simons. And it's Sharp in for Henderson. And a change for the Suns. Booker's checked in. And here's Portland. They're on a 14-2 run here. Here's Sharp. Booker defending. Lillard, a screen on Booker. Sharp passes to Lillard. Here's Sharp. Three-pointer. Phoenix grabs the miss. Bowles got four rebounds now. Booker, the pass to Gordon. Here's Watanabe. 20 points for him last game against the Lakers. It wasn't just the scoring. He got others involved, too. Let's see the stat sheet here for Devin Booker. And he's been outstanding offensively as of late. These last five games, he's been a beast at the offensive end. A different level score than he had been earlier in the season. Let's see if he can keep it up. And he makes a first. Lots of intrigue around Nasir Little and how it is that his game is going to evolve since entering the league. He's consistently worked on developing all of his abilities, shooting, defense, rebounding. The sky's the limit here. And he can't hit the second. The Suns have gotten only two of eight field goals to go in the second. Field, the pass to Watanabe. Boom! He jams it straight down. A good heads up from Bradley Beal. He spots the ready shooter. Portland has gone 7 of 15 from distance in this game. Lots can be said about Bradley Beal's scoring, Grant, but there's more to his game than that. Yeah, B.A., I mean, the shooting is just the most eye-catching part. He also averages solid assist numbers. He plays at a high effort level off ball or on defense. He knew exactly where his man was going to be. Outstanding lead pass. Phoenix has gone just one of six from the perimeter here in the second. Beal into the lane. And no good. Good work defensively by Lillard. Now Portland with it. They're on a 17-4 run. Here's Sharp. It's Little on the wing. Outside Thibel. Pass to Sharp. Beal against Lillard. Shoots over Beal. Lillard can't get it to go. Boy, the Suns are struggling. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Here's Watanabe. From outside, off the mark. He's been off this whole period. Unable to sustain any kind of consistency. Here's Sharp. Booker defending. Little, no good. And for the Suns, they're shooting just 27% in the second quarter. Pass to Watanabe. Booker with it. 18 feet out. Rebound by the Trailblazers. Little's got five rebounds in the game. Lillard passes to Sharp. Lillard, a screen on Booker. Shot left block. 
Portland again missing. Well, Phoenix is shooting just around 32% from the field. Beal left side. Pass to Watanabe. Outside Booker. Beal left side. The Suns need to get off a shot. Watanabe passes to Gord. And they turn it over. Shot clock violation as the buzzer sounds. Jeremy Grant, he's checked in for Portland. Anthony Simons comes in for Damian Lillard. Kevin Durant, he's checked in for the Suns. Goodwin comes in for Beal. The Trailblazers have gone 6 of 11 here in the second quarter. Now here's Simons. He's been a consistent contributor, averaging just over 11 a game. That's good. His first made shot in three attempts. It's just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. Basketball IQ is something that gets talked about, but it's importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. Booker, good. Booker getting the space he needed and just sinks it. And it's Simons with the ball for the Trailblazers. Next matchup, they'll be home against the Nets. And that'll put them halfway through a three-game homestand. Outside Tybal. Pass to Nurkic. Five to shoot to the middle. Stolen by Booker. Good one. Passes to Watanabe. Outside for Booker. There's a screen by Bull. Here's Watanabe. Launches a three. Rebounded by Nurkic. Nurkic has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Down low. Here's Grant. Oh, oh he got his wow. Team down. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. Well, he's so active. you got to box Grant out when the shot goes up. He'll get to the offensive glass. And he rises up off the floor pretty quick. It's been a devastating night for them. Nothing has come easy, Grant. Nothing indeed. Even when they've tried to make adjustments, it just hasn't worked. Bowl is green on Grant. Watanabe passes to Bowl. Outside for Booker. Pass to Goodwin. Five on the clock. Bowl finds Booker. Offline with a three. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Here's Sharp. Booker defending. Grant outside. Gets it to drop. Now two of four. Jeremy Grant becomes consistent in that area. He'll consistently see his minutes go up. Pass to Goodwin. Outside Durant. Here's Watanabe. Phoenix no good that time either. He's cold from distance here in the second quarter. May want to try a different approach moving forward. Here's Nurkic. Misses off the right iron. Nice work defensively. Beating him up top and forcing the miss. Pass to Watanabe for three. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. Well, we're chipping some orange paint off the rim here, guys. He must be more patient on offense and trying to find ways to penetrate inside and get closer to the rim. Ooh, Durant with some nice D. That's the only kind of defense that's going to cut the mustard here tonight. You got to stay on top of a guy like that who can play at such a high level offensively. Bowl with it. Picked up by Grant. Watanabe. Rebounded by Nurkic. Uh, if he's going to keep shooting, they've got to run some plays for him. Screens, pick and rolls, anything they can do to get him started. Simon's shot is good. Well, Simon's known for a guy who can really get it going from behind the line. He can do some damage. He's got length and vertical ability. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Lillard's checked in. DeAndre Ayton, he's checked in for Phoenix. Bradley Beal comes in for Goodwin. One minute left in the first half. Out of bounds, it'll go to the Trailblazers. And let's take an early look at our contenders for this year's dunk contest. No matter who ends up competing, you know it's going to be a show.
And the best part, B.A., every year we see something different, something new. <laughs> I can't wait. Well, you look at Sharp, and he's just short of the number one spot in the voting. No question, it seems that he'll be a factor in the dunk contest. Yeah, B.A., you don't want to have to win in the voting to be the winner on the court come All-Star Weekend. I'm sure he's got what it takes to get some tens from the judges. And there you have it. This year's dunk contest field looks incredible. We'll keep you up to date in the voting. That is always a highlight of All-Star Weekend. Watching guys just fly through the air. And I enjoy watching all of the guys on that list slam it home. Portland has gone 2 of 5 from distance here in the second quarter. From behind the arc. And Aiden pulls it down. Aiden's got four rebounds now. Two second difference between shot and game clock. Pass to Durant to end the run. That one's in there on the nice assist from Beal. Durant's got nine points. It appears their offense is lacking some balance right now. Maybe too much reliance on the three ball. And it's Lillard penetrating. And the dunk by Lillard. Yeah, not something you want to do. You let Lillard drive all the way to the rack, and he will throw it down. Here's Watanabe. Oh, what an incredible end to the corner. Wow, incredible indeed. Waits until the very last second to let it fly. Oh, man, that's got to be frustrating for the defense, too. You just give up momentum like that at the end of the quarter. And so a pretty lopsided game through the first half. It's the Trailblazers just dominating this one. Don't go away. We'll be back momentarily. Hello, everybody. Maybe a bit of a surprise in this one, but what a fantastic first half we witnessed for the Portland Trailblazers. Right now, they're scoring the ball with ease. Good decision-making, kind of punishing the defense for overplaying certain guys. They just seem a step ahead. Or 10 steps ahead. This game hasn't been closed for a minute. And, guys, a look now at who's been really lighting it up from outside the arc. Man, there's some sharp shooters on this list. I would love that opportunity to swat each and every one of their shots. What if they ran off three screens first? Wouldn't matter. I'd go right through those. And that's a wrap on halftime. Thanks for watching as we send you back to B.A. to call the second half. Things will tighten up here in the second. What a game we're seeing from Damian Lillard. Through two quarters of play, he's been an excellent source of points. Yeah, he's, he's shouldering the load right now and looking really comfortable while he's doing it. Inside, it's Grant and Nurkic. Sharp teams with Thibel on the perimeter. And it's Lillard in at the point. That's the group starting the second half for Chauncey Billups. 14 feet away, and it's Portland scoring again. That's a spot where if Sharp can remain consistent and add another level of scoring to his game. Beal, the pass to Aiden. Now Booker. Aiden with a screen. Booker with it. Nurkic picks him up. Aiden. Oh, and the jam by Aiden. With two hands on the rock, he powers it through. Totally in control, protecting the ball the whole way. Here's Sharp. Outside, Tybal. Lillard outside. Fires the three. Bradley Beal with a rebound. And it's Beal with the ball for Phoenix. Pass to Watanabe. And here's Booker. Aiden with a screen. Booker, pass to Aiden. Grant with a steal. Now the Blazers on the move. 
And the dunk by Lillard. I think Jeremy Grant's becoming better and better defensively. Nice job of swiping the ball away that time. And the growth of Jeremy Grant since he came into the league grip. It's pretty remarkable. Pretty good for a former second round pick, an athletic guy that fell under the title of a, a project player, but in Detroit took a larger role on. And I think being able to produce at that level, B.A., has given him the confidence to continue to grow in this game. It's sharp on the wing. Here's Grant. The Suns clear it. And now around two minutes gone by in this half. And Booker just keeps taking him. He's a scoring machine. The Trailblazers have gotten two of four shots to go since the break. For three, here's Lillard. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Ayton's got six rebounds here tonight. Grant with a steal. And another fast break opportunity for the Blazers. Here we go. Plenty of flashiness to his game as Sharp can tie you up with his hands. Pass to Watanabe. Ayton, the screen on Grant. Back to Duran. On the take. Out to Beal. Outside Booker. Here's the three. Rebounded by Nurkic. Nurkic has got 15 rebounds here tonight. Here's Grant. Good. And it's Lillard who picks up the assist. Lillard's got his third assist of the night. And now almost all their points coming from the paint. Booker. The pass to Watanabe. Outside Booker. Beal, right side. Outside for Booker. Six to shoot. Aiden, a screen on Thibel. To the inside. Thibel with a steal. Going inside. It's sharp on the wing. Hounded by Beal. Grant outside. There's a screen. Fires from the line. The Suns clear it. Durant's got his fourth rebound in this one. Pass to Watanabe. Aiden with a screen. The three. And Aiton with the stuff. Defense unable to stop DeAndre Aiton that time getting inside and using his frame. And the Trailblazers call time here. And things are always changing throughout a game. Teams have to adjust on the fly. Timeouts are a wonderful opportunity to just settle in and recollect the thoughts of your entire team. Not just the guys playing, but the entire team. Suns on D. Sharp passes to Thibel. Lillard looking around. And there's the call on Devin Booker. That'll be a second foul of the game. Under the new collective bargaining agreement, the all-NBA teams will now be positionless. What do you think about that, Brent? Yeah, I love it. I mean, you're awarding the players that had the best seasons. And if it happens to be guard heavy or big heavy or wing heavy, so be it. The 15 best players are going to get the acknowledgement that all the hard work and all the consistency and what they put into the season, that's going to pay off. Took a substantial hit there. And Grant able to finish. Wow, that's a bump. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Trailblazers. Well, you love their unselfish play. Keeping that ball moving, good shot to great. That's winning basketball. And I feel like another part of tonight's game has been the hustle. The hustle points, getting up and down, getting second chances, getting transition opportunities. They've been fantastic in that area. Now that play never gets old. The pick and roll will still be an offensive staple 100 years from now. Trust me. Nurkic up top. Here's Sharp. He's got seven. Shot clock at five. Let's it go from deep. Nails it from three. Sharp's got seven points for the quarter. 
at the arc. Sharp just going for it there. He's trusting in his ability. It's Durant with a drive. And Durant with the big finish. He was grabbing the rim to extend the hang time. Hey, maybe making sure the landing was kinder than the takeoff. It's Sharp on the wing. To the paint. And Grant gets it to go. Grant's got 11 points. A slow start for him, but making amends here in the second half. Beal, the pass to Aiden. On the wing, Durant. Watanabe sets a screen. Durant finds Beal over Lillard. Beal's shot is off. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Let's it go from 11. Durant pulls it in. Durant's got his fifth rebound in this one. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. Brian, the NBA is the last of the five major U.S. pro leagues to sign a new TV deal with the existing one concluding after this season. Now talks are heating up and the new deal expected to include traditional cable networks along with some streaming channels, guys. One thing seems clear, it should amount to a big raise for the league and for its players. Mm, interesting point. They'll like that. Thanks, Alec. And here's Lillard. 32 points in the game for him. Shoots over Beal. The Suns clear it. Aiden's got his eighth rebound here tonight. It's Durant with a drive. Three-pointer Beal. And that comes off the assist by Durant. Durant's got four assists in the game. And nice touch, Beal there, making the corner three look as easy as it does. Lillard against Beal. Lillard passes to Sharp. Down low. Here's Grant. Portland, no good that time either. And it's Beal with the ball for the Phoenix Suns. Tipped away. It's stolen by Thibel. Lillard outside. Pass to Nurkic. Takes the 12-footer and hits it. Nurkic just got six points. Lillard has a talent to move the ball. He's developed those sharp instincts. Now a timeout called by Phoenix. Simons is checked in for Lillard. Gordon, he's checked in for the Suns. Phoenix has gone one of four here in the third from range. That was awesome. Fans, join me in thanking. It's Booker on the wing. 12 points for him. Screen by Durant. Beal, the pass to Durant. Out to Gordon. Out to the wing. Clock at six. Durant with a screen on Thibel. It's Booker on the wing. Three-pointer off the mark. The Trailblazers have gone 8 of 15 in the third quarter. Here's Sharp. Hooker defending. A step-back shot. Sharp, no good. The Suns have gone 7 of 13 in the second half. Thibel against Beal. Outside Durant. Gordon with a screen on Grant. Durant, the pass to Gordon. Tries again. And Durant with the lay-in. Durant's got six here in the quarter. Disappointing as a player to have such a great game and still be trailing. Not over yet, though. Here's Simons. And he taps it home with authority. The guard rising up. Simons with some thunder of his own. Out to Beal. Pass to Durant. Let's go with a three. Tybal with the board. Well, if he wants to make the defense work, he's got to start knocking down the threes. Only one so far in this game for him, and none since halftime. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Durant finds Aiden. For three, Booker. Durant with it. Inside. Outside for Booker. Gordon outside. For three, Durant. 
And count it. 8 of 14 now. He's rolling. One this half, two for the game. Stay active from beyond the arc. And here's Simons outside. The Suns clear it. Outside Booker. Outside Durant. Two minutes. With the drive. And it's slammed in by Durant. Durant almost seven feet. It's just hard to believe watching how well he moves. Well, Brent, Durant is at the point of his career where we can discuss if he's one of the best ever. I don't think that we could argue that. He certainly has all of the accolades, B.A., All-Stars, titles, MVPs, finals MVPs. On that 75th anniversary team, just stack them all up. He's right there. Deal with it. Nurkic picks him up. Outside for Booker. For three, Gordon. Heibel with the board. Heibel's got rebound number five here tonight. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. Back to Simons. Three-pointer. Pure from three-point range. Simons got ten points. And Anthony believing in himself that time. Just zero hesitation on that, Jake. Pass to Aiden. It's stolen by Thibel. Here's Sharp. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Aiden's got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. Neal, the pass to Durant. Aiden with a screen. The three is up. Cortland grabs the miss. 26 seconds left in the third. Simons outside. Fires the three. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. He's got a lot to do with the position that they're in a very smart offensive performance tonight from him. Pass to Gordon. Now Aiden, defended by Nurkic. Aiden passes to Gordon. Oh, no good. The dry spell continues. Here's Grant. Oh, got it off in time, but it's no good. And as we conclude the third, pretty much a blowout here. It's been a one-sided affair. Trailblazers out in front, opening up a huge gap. And we're coming right back after this break to get the fourth quarter started. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. You can count on him to deliver a few assists like this one each and every night. Sometimes it happens when the offense is struggling, but every now and then this helps with the offensive uptick right there. Great job of setting his teammate up. there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. And so, in the game for Phoenix, Yuta Watanabe out there with Bull Bull. Then there's Devin Booker. Then there's Kevin Durant. And it's Goodwin in at point guard. And now a chance to see what's coming up for the Portland Trailblazers. On Wednesday, they'll take on Ben Simmons and the Brooklyn Nets. Then on Friday, they'll defend home court against the Indiana Pacers. And he knocks down the first one. And a lot of NBA players and former players are getting into film production. How rewarding has that been, Grant? You know, B.A., storytelling is so gratifying and also so very important. Players do have a voice like never before. And these ventures are just another way of expressing that voice. Yeah, a ripped physical guard. Henderson's competitive nature and drive to keep improving is really impressive. Here's Watanabe. Three-pointer, no good. They've had a slight leg up on the boards and a big leg up on the scoreboard. There's Simons with a three. Bowl grabs the board. bowl has got his eighth rebound here tonight. Watanabe passes to Booker. Back to Watanabe. That one's good. Give the assist to Booker. Booker's got three assists now in this one. Uh, Devin Booker, a shooting guard that does have some point guard skills. Lillard outside. 
true on the 14-footer. Lillard's got 34. Down the stretch, he's been flat out awesome. He helped them get the lead, and now he's making sure they keep it. Badanami passes to Goodwin. Outside Booker. Back to Bull. To the left wing. Four on the clock. Goodwin, no good. How about the unselfishness of this team? <laughs> yeah, the willingness to make the next pass has this defense scrambled. And it's Simons penetrating. Lillard outside. Brown with a screen. Off the mark there with a three. Well, he was terrific in the first half, guys. Maybe some adjustments from the opposing team coach. And he's lost a little bit of that touch here in the second. Oh, it's stolen away. Pass to Bull. Lays it up and in oh, off the oh. pretty assist. Well, those interior passes can be dangerous sometimes, but if the timing is good and you execute it there, you can get easy hoops. Lillard passes to Henderson. Now Simons. The three ball. Buckets. He's now six of ten from the field. This defense is getting spaced out. Three of the last five buckets have come from way beyond the arc. The Suns have gotten half of their attempts to fall in the fourth. Two for four now. And there's the foul. foul. It's on Anthony, Anthony Simons. Simons. That's his first, first foul. No foul. And players now able to first get richer extensions. Foul. Up to 140% of their existing salary. But Brent, what was the impetus for that change? I think in certain cases before, it just didn't make financial sense for players to extend. But if the teams have the ability to go that high above BA and other teams can't offer you that money, you're in that position. You've got to take extensions rather than look for something that's greener pastures. And I think that's going to help teams to retain the players that they value, the players that they've drafted, and the players that they foundationally want to keep to build around. And the Suns miss again. He really hasn't had it offensively tonight. This team needs him to play better. A quick shot there. It's off target. Phoenix has gone 0 for 3 here in the fourth. Pass to Goodwin. Here's Watanabe. He's covered by Simons. Henderson against Booker. Over Nurkic. And his fifth make Devin of the game Booker. in 12 attempts. Now others try to avoid it. Devin Booker tries to find it. That's that mid-range J. Fourth quarter of play and over three and a half minutes have gone by now. Tries to spin move. Simon's shot is good. That's a move you won't see many guys make. Impressive stuff. For Phoenix, they've gotten three of seven attempts in this fourth quarter to fall. Goodwin passes to Watanabe. Sinks it from distance. Watanabe. Watanabe's got five points in the quarter. That's pretty much not how they want to defend the three-point line. Somebody's got to shadow him out there. Over to the left wing. Nurkic a screen on Booker to the middle. For Phoenix, they've got four of eight shots to drop here in this final quarter. Out left to the wing. Pass to Watanabe. There are so many different ways to build a team, Brent. Making trades, you can use the draft, there's free agency. What do you think is the best route? Well, B.A., the, the one critical thing that we need to talk about is what market are we in. And that will start to restrict the ways that, or enhance, the ways that you can build your team. For those L.A. teams and the New York teams, it's probably free agency. Memphis, OKC, San Antonio, you absolutely have to hit home runs. That basket must be widening out right now, and he's making almost every shot he's putting up this quarter. There's a screen by Bull to the inside. And it's off by Bull. You have to prevent him from getting to the paint, unless you want to see a highlight. The Trailblazers have gotten six of ten attempts to drop in the fourth quarter. Outside Little. Back to Lillard. 
this one for three. Hits a three-pointer. Lillard's got 42 in the game. He's putting on a show this quarter, and the team's feeding off his energy. Here's Goodwin, defended by Lillard. A little mid-range shot is up. Rebounded by Nurkic. That might not be the shot they want him taking, even with the D backing off. Simons with it. Jacks up a three. Shot's no good. Seven for 13 now in this game. Okogi, the pass to Watanabe. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. Little's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. To the paint. Inside, Nurkic passes to Little. Henderson against Booker. Down to five on the shot clock. Down low. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. It'll be Phoenix's ball. Sun ball. So for the Blazers. That's Brown, he's court. checked in for use of Nurkic. And it's Penson in for Lillard. Phoenix has gone only one of four from the perimeter here in this fourth quarter. Durant, the pass to Beal. To the left side wing. Pass to Watanabe. Banked it in off the glass. Watanabe's got seven now in this quarter. That's a good find from Aiton, understanding the defensive scheme, and he just waited for his teammate to be open. Little, the screen. And here's Simons outside. It's hauled in by the Suns. Boy, I'd love to see him just get a smidge closer to the basket. Once he sees a few shots go in from there, that might open up everything from distance. Two teammates connecting right there. Slick feed. Henderson outside. Let's it go from 14. And too long on the shot. Well, shots like that drive coaches batty. I'll be shocked if he attempts that shot. And Aiton with the stuff. And Aiton just up over the top at his size to throw that one down. The Trailblazers have gone 7 of 14 here in the fourth from the floor. Simons outside. And there's a pick. Fires for three. He drops it from range. Simons has got 21 points in the game. In today's game, you can never afford to get beat in the three-point battle. To the paint. The kick to Durant from deep. Another three for Durant. Phoenix. After a poor offensive first half, some nice adjustments made by this staff, and their shooting percentage is climbing. The drive by Simons. Oh, denied by Durant. Durant covering a lot of territory with his length. Aiton passes to Watanabe. Another three for Utah, Phoenix. Watanabe. Such an effective shooter. If you lose track of him defensively, he's going to make you pay. For Portland, they've gotten eight of 16 attempted shots to go here in the fourth. Shakes him. Here he goes. And it's good on the lay-in. Attacking the hoop. That is Scoot Henderson's bread and butter. Unstoppable when he's going downhill. Pass to Watanabe. Here's Goodwin. And until recently, it seemed like a foregone conclusion that the NBA's age limit would come back down to 18. Are you surprised that didn't happen, Grant? You know, B.A., I am surprised. We heard players saying Bradley it's not Beal. fair to make guys wait. You know, Commissioner Silver seemed receptive, so that was slightly unexpected that age 19 remains the rule. Simons, right side. Here's Little. And again, it's Portland for the three. Uh, that's such an evolving part of what Nasir can bring, that three-point ball. Durant drives in. Pass to Watanabe. This one for three. That's good. And so Durant with the assist. Three. Durant's got assist number five here tonight. They're enjoying a sizable lead. And what I like, B.A., they haven't stopped pressing the issue. 
and he's easily led the way on the boards tonight. Well, he's been everywhere, and collecting those rebounds, that ends any kind of offensive possession and gets them started. And the Sue Little gets the whistle that time. That'll be a second foul of the game. Murray's checked in for Portland. And the change for the Suns. Devin Booker, he's checked in for Goodwin. Here's Durant. Two minutes in the game. Two A minute 58 left in the fourth. And the layup is good. Durant. Durant's got 25 points in the game. Well, coming off the pick and roll with that length, KD makes so many good decisions. Here's Simons. Oh, and a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. That's the guy they're going to keep going to, as they should. The lead's only going up if they keep feeding him. Durant draws the double. Pass to Watanabe. Takes a three. Here's Aiden. Outside for Booker. Here's Watanabe. Sends it home Utah. from three-point land. Watanabe's got 16 in the second half. It took him a bit to get going, but he's really got that three working now. Henderson finds Simons. Henderson against Beal. Oh, rejected by Beal. Oh, Beal able to get up and get a hand on it. Well, the scoreboard tells you everything you need to know about this one. A great showing here for the Trailblazers. And you don't usually see this kind of blowout, but tonight they delivered the punishment. I mean, what's so impressive is they never wavered in their approach. They just kept at it and showed they were without a doubt the better team. And this will push their total wins for the year up to 11. And after dropping three games to this team on the year, they have to be ecstatic to get the win. And of all the highlights and performances we've seen here tonight, the one thing that stands out is what an unbelievable night it's been for Damian Lillard. He was tough to cover all game long. One of those nights when he felt like nobody could stop him, and they didn't. Henderson, the pass to Simons. Back to Henderson. Fires from deep. Drains the triple. You can feel the excitement in this arena. These guys have done one heck of a job. The huge motivation, always great for a young team, but veteran players also appreciate when fans come with that kind of energy and get into the spirit of the game. Aiden, the screen on Henderson. Beal, the pass to Aiden. Back to Beal. Shot clock at six. Hooker, no good. Here's Pinson. So no problem for Portland as they get the win. Boy, they were something special to watch tonight. And the crowd loving every second of it. It's always a great feeling when you play this well for your fans. This team really showed what it's capable of. All right, let's go courtside to Allie LaForce with Allie. Thank you as always. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Ali LaForce, Brent Berry, Grant Hill, and our entire 2K Sports crew, this is Brian Anderson signing off. So long, everybody.